Boise State won the toss. They defer. They want to defend to open this game. And the football through the end zone, out to the 25. Bonner to throw over the middle. Caught there, Justin McGriff. Cross midfield, and McGriff is into Boise State territory, and they practice with tempo. Bonner, blitz comes, has time, fires, middle. Out of the hands of McGriff. Intercepted for Boise State. Tyreek Jones with the pick, and the Broncos have the football in great field position. You're gonna see right here, he's gonna hit, it's wide open. That's the loose defense that you could possibly have. This is exactly what they want. The exact pass they used before, there's nobody within 10 yards, but unfortunately McGriff can't hold it. And Boise has the ball at midfield. Broncos, that's Shakir in motion. They will line him up everywhere. From their 42, Bachmeyer, short throw, caught in the flats. That's Shakir, and he's got the first down, a gain of about 14 yards. We're already here. Long count for Bachmeyer. He'll pull it. 35, gets the edge, and has the first down to the 28. Hunter Reynolds made the stop. Polani now who lines up and takes a direct snap. He'll pull it. Holani tripped up right at the stick. Has the first down at the 17. Field goal tipped at the end of the Oklahoma State game. Up and good. Boise State forces a turnover. A nice drive. Tyler has a seam. And a nice gain across the 40. Bonner has time, and another man wide open. Tompkins, that middle, as you said, is really soft right now. They're being too soft. They're allowing them free access on the inside. That's just a breakdown. They formation is key. Tyler, 35-yard line, defending the run for Boise State. This is right about the limit for field goal range for Utah State. Bonner, time, man open, deflected. Broken up. Shea Oladipo coming over. Drives, they scored points. Blitz comes, Bonner's got time, steps up, fires, sideline, incomplete. He had two receivers down there. No flag, and the Broncos defense gets the ball back. Thomas again has the first down. Metzenheimer makes the stop, but not before he's into Utah State territory. El Elian Noah is in the backfield. Tompkins with a catch. That's a heck of a throw to the far side of the field. Coordinator to take advantage of a run game that's humming. Noah again. This time he's through. The 40 hauled down at the 30. Just a good job. Fourth down opportunity. This is third and 11. Bonner scrambling, fires it out. Gentry with the catch, racing for the sticks, and has it. I think the official hasn't spotted it. Yes, first down. Bonner in trouble, and down he goes. And the Broncos have their seventh sack of the season. At home wants to get, excuse me, third down. Bonner, end zone, oh. incomplete. Blocked. It looked like Scott Matlock. And the Broncos hold on to the lead. And Boise's winning this early matchup. Both offenses have moved the football. Bachmeyer over the middle. Caught there. Shakir racing to the 10, down to the 7. 69 yards. Their big mauler on the opposite side, but we talked about Shakir in the open. The yards after the catch, and look how much hustle his teammates have. Not very many people can catch him from behind. Bachmeyer in trouble, caught, 
swings it into the end zone. There's a wrestling match. Evans was interfered with. First and goal. Van Buren still alive and in. Touchdown, Boise State. What an excellent run by Van Buren there. His fourth touchdown on the year. He was hit in the backfield at about the three yard line right there, but he keeps his legs driving. That's two tackles he's broken. Gets hit with a third before he crosses the goal line center and ready to rock. They're up tempo. Bonner's throw over the middle and it's caught a sliding Tompkins right at midfield. And you see Tom. Utah State with the football to start the second quarter. Tyler gets the edge and the first down. Or they may consider going for it. Bonner flushed, spins, looks, deeks, fires, end zone, and it's intercepted. Boise State has their second pick. LaBeouf again. And to make matters worse, there's a player down for Utah State just a panic throw that time by Logan Bonner well defended and again that's LaBeouf who's winning his matchup with McGriff he's in phase the whole time you see him there he gives him a little bit of space and the ball is just overthrown a bad decision a bad throw by Bonner and Boise State has their second INT Aggies if they could force the punt from the seven got to get to the 11 Bachmeyer fires silent man wide open caught there Likio up the sideline, cross midfield, inside the 40. Huge play for the Broncos. Field for the big game to cross midfield. 55 yards, 38 yard line. Got it out. No. Started one and three. Broncos start this, and Bachmeyer pulls. And escapes across the 25 to the 28. That's a 12-yard gain. Bringing pressure. Third down five. Pressure on Bachmeyer. Gets it away. It's caught. That's Cutter. Coach's kid. Wow, beautiful punt. Nathan, uh-oh, makes the catch at the one. Not a good decision. Uh -oh. And he's hit and dropped, and he's in the end zone. Did he get out? Wow, they're going to give him forward progress there. I thought he was free and still looked like he was trying to run. He should have never fielded that football in the first place. But the Aggies get really, really Going lucky the field, there. Forward progress to that one half yard line. First down. You should never field a punt there. There's so much can go wrong, and it's this. He's free there now, and he's trying to run. He has not stopped. I don't think that he had forward progress there. The Aggies got lucky. Third down five, Bonner's throw on the money there. That's Derek Wright with the catch. Wright spins away, midfield, out to the 40. Second down, Tyler again. First down, inside the 20. Clock stops, they move the chains. That's Devin Tompkins, Bonner fires, caught Derek Wright, and then it's out of his hands. He's already blocked one. Coles. And this one is no good. I don't know that I've ever seen a team move the ball with such explosiveness and get shut out in a half. Aggie offense shot itself in the foot way too many times. Whoa! Again, Bachmeyer will pull it, and again, it's a big game. He has been a huge part of the ground game today. But this Utah State offense can take advantage of this defense. 90, they need to. 94 yards away, and it's Tyler, Tyler across Jr. the 20 and out to the 27. It's good to see that Markel Reed has come back into the game. They're getting a lot. It's a fake. Constantly, oh my goodness, what a disaster. Yeah. 
An absolute meltdown by Utah State. I don't understand this. This is such a panic play by this Utah State team. From the 18, great field position. Bachmeyer, lots of time, pumps, Take looks, it. throws, caught, Shakir. Down to the two. What a job by Bachmeyer and Khalil Shakir. I thought he was going to run this, but this just turns into the scramble drill. Shakir, when this play's broken down, his route stops there, but he's mirroring the quarterback, showing him his numbers to give Bachmeyer an option to throw. Bachmeyer rolling, fires, caught! Shakir! Touchdown, Broncos! Rich, there's only about a two-foot window where this ball can be thrown. The accuracy on the frozen rope. Bachmeyer's so good at frozen throws, he puts it just outside of the outstretched hands of the defender, who was so close to him. But if that ball's up behind a little bit, the DB can get his hand and close the gap and knock it away. Paisley looks, setting up a screen left side, fires it over the head of Tyler. Press coverage, maybe take a shot. Bachmeyer going to take that shot, and it's Evans with the catch. That's breathing room and more. 15 yards. Bachmeyer fires at the sticks. That's a first down. What a nice play. Riley Smith found the yardage, and Bachmeyer found him. Shakir, top of your screen, single coverage. Thomas in motion. Bachmeyer under pressure again. Whoa, wow. what a catch there. Billy Bowens had a man all over him. The junior. Two things here. You have to create separation with quickness off the snap, but he fights back the location of the football. Blitz comes. Bachmeyer, back foot throw. It's picked. A Johnny Carter came out of nowhere. Did he get the foot down for the pick? The top of the screen there, that makes those free releases easier. He's got him. Man open, caught at midfield. Brandon Bowling. Play call there. Gentry gets outside. He's 30, race for the pylon, knocked out of bounds. He's one of their best running weapons. Keep it up the middle, John Gentry with time melting away. They have been, but don't break. Utah's got to make them pay. Peasley keeps in trouble, and he's hammered. J.L. Skinner again, fourth and goal. Where do you go now? You go field goal. This is still a two-score game. Oh. This one was low, but it got through. And finally, after all that offense, Utah State is on the board. Hank Bachmeyer, blitz comes. He's got time. He's got a man. That's C.T. Thomas. Breaks the tackle. Cross midfield. 46 yard line, 24 yards. George Holani, big hole, breaks to the outside, inside the 30, and a flag is down, and that feels like either a face mask or a horse collar. Up and good. It's not seven, but an important three points. Peasley waiting, flush, lost the football. It's loose, and it's scooped up, and Boise State has it. And this week, there's no whistles. Matlock forced it. Washington recovered it. Third down five, Bachmeyer fires, caught, whoa, Halani, and he's got the first down. 
Bachmeyer again put that football right where it had to be. And it had to be thrown quickly. It's not just where to throw, it's when to throw. If he waited any longer Minutes. with one timeout. Bachmeyer, corner, Shakir, no. Oh. Flag is down. Shakir in the corner, Cam Lampkin on the coverage. And the flag came from that corner. Pass interference, defense, number six. Bachmeyer looking, oh man, wide open, touchdown. That's Matlock. <laughs> Scott Matlock, a defensive lineman. His dream has come true. There's nothing better than fat guy touchdowns. He's right here. He's made so many plays, blocked a field goal. Utah State's not even accounting for him. They're expecting run. Matlock makes them pay. What an incredible play call. Has there been anybody that's had as good of a day as Tim Plow, the offensive coordinator? Oh, in the backfield, the walk on who now has a scholarship. Bachmeyer pulls it again. That's been a real important component to the run game for Boise State. <laughs> Buckle your junk. That is Tyler Crow. Crow was a linebacker coming in, a walk on linebacker. They switched him to running back. He's a, a special teams demon. And it was a big moment for him and for the whole team. Went ticking away. Hank Bachmeyer was outstanding. Khalil Shakir, terrific. And Andy Avalos and the Broncos even their record at two and two with a decisive 27 to three win on the road in front of a packed house in Logan, Utah. Nice game partner. We'll see you next weekend right back here in Logan for Aaron Taylor, Sherry Burris, our entire CBS crew. I'm Rich Walt saying so long from Logan, Boise State, 27 to three. We'll get you back to Adam Zucker and company in the studios right after these messages. Goodbye from Logan.